Krasinski of the Rochester Nighthawks. Welcome to the next draft day flashback with Stephen Keogh of the Rochester Nighthawks. And Stephen, let's go back to your draft day, September 21st, 2011. It's in your hometown of Toronto. What types of emotions were you feeling when you were waiting to hear your name called? Uh, you know, I was sitting there, I was uh, really excited. Uh, I had a lot of family and friends uh, in attendance. And uh, of course, I was nervous, but uh, hearing your name called, it's something you dream of uh, as a little kid. So it was, it's a great experience. You get picked by the Nighthawks second overall, and you're reunited with some of your former SU teammates, Cody Jamison and Sid Smith. That had to have been thrilling to not only be joining some of the former Orange players, but joining an organization like the Nighthawks. Yeah, you know, uh, joining Sid and Cody was, uh, was great. I, I became really close with them uh, at Syracuse. Uh, in Rochester, you know, it's a great city. When I was at Syracuse, I used to go up and watch uh, the Nighthawks play, so I knew, I knew about the atmosphere and the city, so it was, it was fun. And, uh, you know, just to uh, come in and do anything I could do to help the team was great, and uh, it was a lot of fun, uh, and I'm glad uh, to be a part of an organization like Rochester. So you come in and you have one of those starts that, you know, you just read about in magazines or see in a movie. Your first three seasons with the Nighthawks, you win three straight championships. I don't think you could have scripted it any better. You, you're probably extremely excited uh, when you won the first one, but then you add two more to that. Yeah, you know, it was, uh, it, was, it was pretty crazy. It was a lot of fun. Uh, the first year, you know, we had an up-and-down season, and then we kind of clicked towards the end. And, uh, you know, that first Champions Cup, uh, you know, when I was a kid, I used to go to the Rock Games, watch them, uh, you know, hoist the tr trophy. So that's something I dreamed of, and it was a pretty uh, surreal experience to be able to do that. This year's draft class, there'll be five players that become Rochester Nighthawks. What advice do you have uh, to the youngsters that will be joining the organization? Uh, you know, uh, enjoy it. Uh, you know, it's, it's a great day for you guys. Uh, but, you know, it's the start of uh, lit little things and just go out and uh, work hard after your name's called and just enjoy it. Thanks a lot, Stephen. This is Craig Urbzinski for Nighthawks TV.